When you have high cholesterol levels, it becomes essential to manage those numbers better to prevent the onset of a stroke or any other heart disease. Aside the drugs that your doctor may prescribe to help you bring down the numbers, you also need a lifestyle and diet change. This simple habit will make it easier for you to transition from your old diet and lifestyle into a healthier, more active one. Number one, know the difference between good and bad cholesterol. The body typically only needs small amounts of cholesterol, especially the good type. Unfortunately, a lot of food that we eat contains too much cholesterol, especially the bad kind. Low density lipoproteins, LDL, the bad cholesterol is gotten from saturated fatty acids, especially in the food of animal origin. It transports cholesterol to your heart and too much LDL may cause plague to build up and block your heart arteries. High density lipoproteins, HDL on the other hand, transports cholesterol to the liver, helping the body get rid of the bad cholesterol so it doesn't end up in the arteries. Number two, be active. Physical activity, even as little as 30 minutes every day of the week, can help to lower the bad and increase the good cholesterol levels in your body. It will help you maintain a healthy weight and reduce the risk of clogged arteries. It doesn't have to be tedious either. Aerobic exercises like a brisk walking or running are excellent ways to start. Physical activity isn't limited to the gym. You can play with your kids, dance, walk your dog, garden, do house chores or hike, just as long as you're moving. Number three, choose healthier food options. Fruits and vegetables contain a lot of antioxidants that can lower LDL levels. They also have a lot of fiber that keeps you too full to eat fatty foods, keeping your weight and blood pressure and even cholesterol levels in check. Beans and whole grains like whole wheat, oatmeal and brown rice also contain more fiber that will keep you fuller for longer while controlling your blood sugar and cholesterol levels. Number four, unsaturated fats are better. You cannot exclude fat from your diet because you need, believe it or not, you need fat. The type of fat and the quantity you consume is all that matters. Choose unsaturated fats like those found in olive, canola, and sunflower oils. Oversaturated fats found in meat, butter, dairy, and palm oil. Additionally, nuts like pecans, almonds, and walnuts are a good snack option. And finally, boost your omega-3s. Omega-3 is a type of fat that helps you to lower triglyceride and cholesterol levels in the blood, slowing the development of plague in the heart arteries. A good source of this is going to be fatty fish like tuna, sardines, salmon, and trout. If you'd like to see a full list of seven different things that you can do to slow down your cholesterol levels, please visit the link in the description and we will see you on another video by Be Your Fitness.